really good energy. There were a lot of people, like you said. Um, I think the timing of it was good because we had a couple of really well-run events. The 800s, the 1500 on the men's side, there were some things that we did really well and they had a lot of people there when, the, when those events we were being contested, so it was kind of cool. It was, you know, those are NCAA qualifying marks and, and I was, I, yeah, I thought it was fun. This is amazing. I mean, we had such a great turnout out here and we got to see other athletes. I, you know, I saw swimmers out here and uh, other, I saw basketball players too come through and just a phenomenal experience to be in front of the home crowd. It's a blast. Um, I think one of my favorite experiences when I've been here at MSU is competing at your home field. Um, there's a lot of Spartan fans here that encourage you throughout the race, so it's always it's always a great time coming here and competing in your hometown. Yesterday, uh, Hannah, Tim, and Noah, uh, you know, Hannah and uh, Noah winning. Um, I thought their marks in the pole vault were good and I thought that, you know, so it's, it's kind of nice to see a little bit of progress. It's nice to see KD throw a little bit further every, you know, I said it's a good sign of maturity when, when you come out and you throw a little bit further um, every meet instead of hitting big marks and trying to hold on to it. I think she's going to do a nice job of just growing into being who we, who we know she is and that's one of the best people in the country. Training is really paying off so far this year, finally having like consistent um, running and workouts and continual from all the way from cross country season, um, and that makes a huge difference. And it's it's uh, it's really paying off right now. Um, hopefully, when we have um, more races and stuff, it'll it can be more competitive, and we can um, kind of challenge things a little bit more. But um, it's working out pretty well so far. The marks weren't quite as good. We ran into a little bit of a headwind, uh, but it was nice to see David get off the mark. I don't think he's ever opened that fast. It's probably, honestly, one of his top four or five times of, uh, in his career. So I think it's a really good place for him to start. Um, the intermediates are one of those races where you kind of get in sync and then it goes faster. Um, I thought the, the freshmen ran the, the intermediates well, too. I mean, obviously, Alex Wader ran well, but those guys, for their first time running 400 meters um, over the hurdles, I thought they did a nice job. 